I think the most exciting thing for me about being an aquarist is that every day is different. I never expected to take care of whole trees like mangroves. Okay, stop. That's not gonna work. You learn a lot on how to MacGyver. Mangroves are super special because they essentially live in the water. The root system creates a place that kind of breaks the waves and that provides a space for bigger animals to come in and have their babies and lay eggs. And those smaller animals can thrive in that space before they go into the open ocean. The mangroves are really kind of a cornerstone species in the coral triangle. So uh, it was something that was uh, really important to us to be able to include in the Ocean Pavilion project making sure that we're getting across the really important concept that there is just one world ocean. As an aquarist, I did not anticipate becoming a mangrove expert. Seattle Aquarium has never had mangroves in their care before. The whole team has worked together to do research and contact other facilities. So it's been a fun learning experience. The plants were grown in an outdoor nursery in Florida for the last few years. And one of the things that we wanted to really be very careful about was making sure that we weren't accidentally bringing in any bugs, any pests, uh, anything like that on these plants. I don't know what's in here. I'm like scared that a spider or something is gonna just jump out of here. Personally, I was looking for iguanas, but I didn't see any. We did find some mealybugs. I definitely did not expect to be going through with like magnifying glass, going through every single leaf to make sure all those leaves are clean so that they could photosynthesize properly. Moving the mangroves was something that we knew from the beginning was going to be a challenge. The trees were five, six feet tall and they weighed, you know, 400, 450 pounds. The aquarium industry is pretty small. If you need to find a solution for something, there's not a product out there that you can purchase. So you have to be very creative. You learn a lot on how to MacGyver. You see what you have in your toolbox, and then you put something together to make it work. We got this. This is going to work. When we were able to reach in with that custom lifting strap and, and secure it around the base of the plant, I was just so relieved. Because as soon as I saw it lift up, we got it a couple inches, I'm like, this is going to work. Woo! We got one tree. All of the logistics and the creativity to maneuver them is pretty exciting. And then you do the next nine. <laughs> When the mangroves move from the animal care center into Ocean Pavilion, we really want visitors to take away how interconnected the mangroves are to the survival of stingrays and the other fish that live within that ecosystem. And humans are interconnected into that as well. Healthy mangroves mean a healthy ocean, which ultimately means a healthy planet for all life. We're so incredibly excited about bringing on the blue spotted rays and introducing them to that mangrove environment. It just seemed like a, a real perfect partnership. And then they get distracted by each other. <laughs>